Um, hello, YouTube. This is going to be a take on of the iPod Nano fourth generation. Um, this thing is um three months old. I got it in November, but I didn't open it until Christmas. And it's a good product. It's already opened. But um, I really want to sell it to get an iPod Touch. So, yeah, here's an unboxing. It's a big tape here. So you open that up. Then you take out the iPod. iPod. Um, I can't actually show you what's on it right now because the battery's low. But I'll be doing a review of this in another video, so stay tuned. So, um, yeah, and to take it out, you kind of push this thing back like that. So you have it, your iPod. And, um, here's your USB cord. Um, uh, yeah, I didn't keep the original plastic wrapping for it, but why would I? And, uh, so, let's put this in. And you got your dock adapter. That's really hard. Oh, can't use it. And, uh, you got your, um, pamphlet thing, product information, and your iPod Nano guide for syncing and stuff. So, um, designed by Apple in California. Not sure if you can see that. But, um, this is a really good product. Um, for me, it's a little bit boring. I was expecting a little more, but it's really good for basic music usage, and um, it's actually really good on videos. And uh, the Shake to Shuffle feature, um, that's a new thing. That's kind of impressive, but it gets annoying sometimes when you're walking down the stairs and you're holding it in your hand and it'll change the song on you. But, yeah, you can use the whole switch to disable that, and, yeah, I'll talk about that more in another video, so, thank you.